Hello? Hello? Yeah. Go. Here. Killian. Here it. Someone's back. Going. Uh, she's up. Here. Royer. Here. All right. Let's see, Royer's here. Yep. Need to start. Yep. Okay. Play recap since last time. It's been a while. He only gets one free reroll. Yay. Yay. One free reroll. Yeah, he's that's his. Any session until basically next round. Use it wisely. Until next when? And next Christmas. <clears throat> From last time, you guys managed. Then proceeded to inform it is the juggernaut, you bitch. Uh, Uh, find out that you have fought some low-level Legion Raiders. Um, due to injuries sustained by two or three members of the group, it required you to stay over in the town. Luckily, it was provisioned enough. You guys didn't have to touch into your supplies, as well as witnessing a flashback from the past when you guys explored the bomber the town was named for. So, I'm uh, pretty sure loot was taken care of as well. I am not sure. Possibly. Uh, yeah, it was... But it was high on acid, so. Looks right to me. I'm looking at a note. Yeah, it's in Preacher's Ledger, too. Yep, it's good. We didn't divvy it out, did we? No, we no. didn't. Well, that can wait until we're completely done. Yeah, that's what All we said. Right. That's what we said we we're going to wait for. All okay. right. So, <clears throat> you guys have been holed over for 10 days, um, which means next time I roll for. I'm making notes. Um, next time I roll for. Business stuff for the Holy Goblin. I need to add plus 10 days to it. And then Coach is going to come back and be like, I retired. Yeah. And Preacher's done. Wow, that's a lot of cash. What about the Wasteland? Fuck the Wasteland. Fuck the Wasteland. I got whores and booze. I'm good. All right. So... You guys are about to set off again, headed for the abandoned Scarlet Warthog camp that you guys had heard about through people passing through the, the bar that you guys are going to investigate for more signs and traces of the Legion to gather more information before trying to hunt down the Legion itself. Oh. Is there anything anyone wants to do before we leave Bomber Town? You know? Right here, fuck a demon into existence. Uh, let's go with the second one. No, let's not. I like fucking demon. <laughs> All right. Oh, no, I'm good. All right. Um, and just so everyone knows, um, James unfortunately has to drop due to work conflicts. So I'll be running. needs to do, we will set out from the town. Uh, I can't think of anything I need to do. Oh, I'm just ready to mosey on. Brutus is good. we diving after this. Diving. Diving. As in division? 
No, as in dividing. dividing. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. Not true. Okay. So, yes. <clears throat> divvying up the loot. All right, oh, so. No, no, no. Both. Vision. Okay. So, as you guys set out from the town, back out into the wastelands, whoever's leading the group, I need a survival check. Zach. Zach. You broken piece of crap. Come on, buddy. You said survival? Yep. <laughs> so, you guys have gone off course, and we're going to have to have another day of travel. Um, you know... Money for me. <laughs> Really, uh, this is a good start. This is a good start. This guys. is a great start. All right. Uh, maybe I should have did the survival. I, I do have a plus three. Yeah, it would probably be you, dude. I have a plus seven in survival. Never mind. All right. So, for this day that you guys spent wandering in the waste, kind of lost following Zach's lead, I'm going to need either survivals for food and water. Or you guys need to burn from your supply. Take two. There we go. <clears throat> All right, give me one second. So, Odloff. Food and water. Not find food. You do not find food or water. Okie dokie. So you need to burn from your supply. Okay. Elsa. Why did you roll two? Oh, Shire, man. One for shelter, one for food and water. Okay, so Elsa, so Shiza finds manages to find you guys a very good shelter, actually, um, well positioned, kind of alcove in the rocks um, and stuff like that, as well as she manages to find herself food but not water. Preach manages to find himself food and water. Zach, no, and Tolo, no. So everyone's got to burn. Uh, water. Nope, Preach doesn't. Actually, actually, I'm going to just go ahead and let you guys know this. No one's actually burning any water from their stash because Doc has Create Water. She's been refilling your canteens every night when you guys sleep. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> Look at that. Looky there. Okay. Yeah. Um, so pretty much you guys are good on water until Doc goes away. Oh, I was like, I must be going blind because I just emptied this canteen last night. Oh. The heck, my eye's not working. All right. So with that being said, I need perception checks from three people in oh. order of who's taking the watches. I'll take first watch. No, I got this. I got second. I got second. Third, then. I got third watch, fam. First watch. All right, Olaf. Advantage, um, so I got 11. You don't see or hear anything out of the ordinary. Okay. She's, uh, <clears throat> as you are standing watch during the night, you actually do see some people kind of moving through the area as well. It looks like a, another group of wastelanders, but they keep their distance from your guys. How many of them are there? Three or four. Wait, what? <laughs> Did you just say Zach? Don't do it. Four. Don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> So, yeah, I, I'm just going to have my rifle trained on them until they leave. Yeah, they're kind of just moving through the area. You can tell they're, they're moving at night. Um, go ahead and roll me another perception check on them if you want. Uh, okay. Uh, advantage because they're more than 25 meters away? Um, yep. Um, as you focus in closer to your scope and kind of your dark vision from your heritage and stuff takes over a little bit, you are able to tell that one of them doesn't look quite right. In what way? Physically. There's something about the way they move and just like carry themselves doesn't look right. Mutant, burn the heresy. <laughs> Pick. Um, pretty much. <laughs> I. Yes, I'm going to wake up the group leader, Zach. And uh, warm him real quick. Uh, what? It's a group moving by, but one of them seems to be moving oddly. 
What 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 do you mean oddly? I describe it the best of my ability. It's like a weird shambling gait that doesn't seem to apply to any like race he's encountered before. Then <sighs> carries himself right. weird. Oh, let me see your rifle so I can see this fuck. She passes her rifle across reluctantly. I'm okay. just looking. I'm not shooting. Zach, he's so you have tired. A... His finger slips. <laughs> You, you can see the person he's she's talking about and kind of see what she's talking about, but you really can't make out anything else beyond that. Yeah, it's too dark out to really tell. I can see him clear as day. What are you talking about, dark? I just woke up. Fuck off. <laughs> you want me to do anything about it? You want me to shoot him? Stop him? What? As long as, 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 long as they stay away, we ought to be fine. All right. So it's a gunfight in the middle of the night without flash suppressors. Not really a good idea. All right. With that, I'm going to take my rifle back, and I'm going to study them the best I can. All right. Um, memorize a feature just in case they attack us later. Go ahead and roll me a knowledge nature check. Or a... You can use nature, or I'll let you even use medicine on this. Medicine. So, wow. I'll Ooh, take this would have been my nature. Oh, not bad. Uh, I'll take the 19. Um, <laughs> so, as you study the one that's kind of moving kind of awkwardly and funnily and stuff like that, and you can kind of guess with your medical knowledge that the person that they're moving with, it's probably a group of mutants fleeing persecution for the mutant city. Oh, okay. That, that or the other thing you know it could possibly be, it could be something you just don't want to mess with. Unknown creatures in the wastelands impersonating people. Mm. Gotcha. So it's either harmless or extremely harmful. Pretty much, yeah. Yeah, okay. With that, All I right. just keep an eye out for them. All right. I'll need a perception check for third watch. Got it. <laughs> No, I don't. I don't see it. I don't see it. I don't see it yet either. It ought to pop up here in a second. Oh, you know what? I'm rolling under GM layer. That's why. Are you in the game as a GM? Yeah, I keep forgetting that you put me on here as a GM. Yeah, in case you don't edit any of the system. Yeah, so let me... I'm just going to... So I'm going to put it on to me as not a GM if I can do that. Yeah, just go to settings, rejoin as player. Uh, tell me, tell me if you see this real quick, just so I can do it. I saw a fourteen perception. Yeah, I see the fourteen. Oh. Yeah, that's me. Join this player real quick. All right, here we go. Uh, do I see anything? Hmm. Fourteen. Do I see anything? Oh no, nothing but the creeping over the horizon. As your watch draws to an end. And you guys continue with another day of travel. All right. So I'm going to need a survival check from the leader. OK. Oh, wait. That was the wrong one. You're, you're... OK. Uh, you want me to roll another one and just apply those to what it says there for? No, you're good. The 11's fine to not get lost. OK. Um. Considering you guys do have a map. Yep. Which I'm pretty sure a map would just give you advantage on survival. Oh, so the 27. Yeah, to find survival to find, to not get lost. All right, so you guys managed to uh, not get lost for the day. And uh, she's has already ro rolled for food and water by accident for the night. She is uh, good on both. So I want to go ahead and look for shelter. And you guys want to roll for food and water? I'll use... roll one more for shelter then. Okay. Uh, Shiza does not manage to find a decent shelter for the night. What about me? You find an okay shelter. We'll go with okay, Baron, and not decent. No. <laughs> All right. Is anyone looking for food and water today? I'm just or to ration. I'll check. For, I will check for food and water. All right. Preach, you find food. Well, you guys don't actually have to look for water, thanks to Todd. She's a cornman and a water buffalo just in one <laughs> second. All right, preach, you find some food. 
Yeah. Tolo, you don't find any food. Damn lizard's still getting yeah. away from you, bud. <laughs> well, I mean, when the ground tremors and shakes like an earthquake, you tend to leave. You know what? I'll see if I can find food. Fuck it. You don't find <laughs> I don't find me and Me and Brutus must be just walking side by side. A hulking bear man and a hulking wolf man. <laughs> you know, you're not going to find much. <laughs> All right. So it is now the next day of travel. You guys are traveling to the abandoned camp. And oh, we don't need to roll for the next launch. No, there was nothing that night. I had to roll because you guys had a suspicious wastelander encounter. But oh time. boy, time that ninety-seven comes home to roost. Oh boy. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and start rolling up. I need to roll up because I have a couple of things to control. Move mm -hmm. it around. Why does this feel like a good spot for an ambush? You don't say. <laughs> because it's an extremely good it's spot a for a wonderful ambush. spot for an ambush. All right. We got Peter in there and Doc. Okay. So you guys can set up your tokens however you want in marching order. Um, kind of don't go above that bush right there to the right. Right here? Yep, Bruce. Yeah, right about here. Okay. So yeah. scoot back. I'm going to want a wide berth on this one. I'm going to use as I'm going to use as much fucking cover that I can possibly do. Have a dock out here in the wings. I'll walk up the center. We know. Flying B. Brutus unafraid. Where All right. Um, um south, southern area. <clears throat> Brutus is about as far forward as you can get. Yep. Dead wedge though. All right, everyone can give me okay. opening perception checks. Nineteen, sir. Twenty. Brutus is walking. I don't see nothing but the sand. I'm walking with my head down. Yeah. You're looking for the IEDs. He's looking at his feet. <laughs> I'm sort of hit something. <laughs> All right. Um, so, as you guys scan the area ahead, Brutus, uh, let's see, let me see, not Brutus, uh, Odloff, you would hear this. Shiza, you would see this. Uh, and yeah, that's really about all the uh, forewarning you're going to get. Oh, boy. Um, so, Odloff, you hear the, some, the sound of something eating. Oh, and good. Shiza, you see movement up in... Gotta go back to the player. Up in this general area. Oh, all the way up there. Okay. I... I point my rifle in that direction, and I let them know as quietly as possible. There's something moving up ahead. And we're going to go to initiative order just for ease of turn and ease of turns. Oh, I didn't get a bad one this time. Swarm of Tyranid. Brutus. Zach. Be good. Son of a fucking, there we go. There it is, okay. Oh, look. The brothers are... Uh, yeah. Zach, you are first. I'm fucking... I'm gonna move to... And that rock, and I'm gonna do... That's the bush. I'm gonna move behind that bush. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna go get behind that concealment, not that cover. Correct. Um, so as you look forward, Zach, you're really not seeing what she's pointed out or really anything in general, and you don't hear anything either. My turn, then. All right. Olaf. All righty. My turn. I'm going to go up here. 
a little more behind the rock. There we go. And um, you can still hear something eating. All right, and I'm going to pull out my trusty SMG for just in case. All right. And in my turn. So Peter, you just gotta stick up here with uh, with Zach. All right, one second. That thing is resting. She's a. Uh, um, okay. I am, I, I have line of sight on this thing, right? It's like in the bushes and stuff like that. I mean, you have like kind of a line of sight, but just with where it's at, it's hard to make out what it is. Where okay. is this thing at? Uh, full action to sight in, seeing as I can at least see some of it, right? Um, Up bonus north. action, perception. Okay. <laughs> so, I will send you a message. Because you can tell what it is now. Death Claw! Oh, God. If it's that. No, I feel like it's something worse. Yeah. I feel like it's, it's a 97, worse. so it's bad. Okay. Um. Fuck. <laughs> Should we prepare thy assholes? Uh, I think assholes need prepared with that words of language that she used. So. Uh, who's in like whispering distance to me? I'm assuming pre preach. Preach. Uh, about preach only. Uh... Yeah. It's a death claw. <laughs> really? Right. That's what she says. Preach is gonna look over at her, and it's in this bush over here, right? Like here. I no, point to it's way up north. <laughs> I point oh. to it. To oh, it's I way up thought. there. Okay. <sighs> okay. So apparently the only one that heard me though is Preach. Preach is the only one that heard you, but it's Preach's turn. <laughs> yeah. So I'm gonna move. Movement and dash. And that will be my turn. All right. Brutus. Brutus is just going to walk forward. <laughs> we need walkie talkies. Are things you guys can get. They are also <coughs> really rare and really not, are really expensive. Yeah. They're not a cheap yeah. item. If only someone had the cantrip call. message. Go ahead. I have the cantrip message. That's a one-way radio. Okay, Brutus. Um, you can tell about from moving up here in this bush, and you can tell what it is. Death claw. It's a death claw, yes. And it is eating something. Hopefully it's eating that cunt. I'm going to stop moving. And I'm going to very carefully put my shield down between me and it. Okay. One's busy eating. So Doc is just going to kind of keep up with the group here on the level. Zach, it is your turn. All right. Nope. I, yeah, we're good, guys. I don't know what you guys are freaking out about. <laughs> okay. All right. Odloff, your turn. Okay. Uh, do do do. Boop. 
pretty much what you already knew. Oh, that's stealth. Oh. <laughs> Oh, you're rolling for a stealth, huh? Yeah. Gotcha. And Peter's just going to keep up there. There. All right. She's that you're hiding out there? Yep. It has disadvantage if it wants to see me. And I think I'm going to need that. What the frick? Frick what? She's in Olaf pull, rolls the exact same stealth. Like, oh, damn. <laughs> to the T. Uh, yeah, and after that, I am going to ready in action to fire at that thing. If it come if it comes down to it, all right. right. If it starts becoming hostile, preach. Oh, it's my turn again. <laughs> yep. Ugh. Um. meters there and th is this like an uh, incline or what's up it's like a ridge line would i be able to climb it would it take 10 yeah you know, it's, it's basically it? be difficult terrain okay five thirty all right That's, uh, and then I'm going to, Zach, do you know about it yet, that it's a death claw? No, you don't, because I see that perception. <laughs> I... Guys, we're, we're good. I don't know what you were freaking out about. The fluffy message, <clears throat> message, I'm going to tell Preach, uh, not Preach, I'm going to tell <laughs> Zach that, uh, we have a death claw up ahead in the bushes, so get to an elevated position. All right, Brutus, it's your turn. Roger, apparently I just lost connection with the server, but I'm going to try. Um, okay, there it is. I'm back. There's nowhere good for me to get here. All right. There, and another perception. Okay. Oh. Yeah, that's definitely a death claw up there. And you can tell it's eating what looks to be like some people. Oh. Hmm. Oh, hey, it's that group we saw last <laughs> night. They're doomed to us. Maybe. That's actually what I was going to ask. Maybe. You, you would have to really get a better look at those bodies to know for sure, and they look a little preoccupied. All right. <laughs> All right. Wait, what direction were those people walking in? The same one that we are heading in? Opposite, but that doesn't mean they didn't get lost. True. So Doc is actually going to come up there. They'd have to have gotten really lost. <laughs> Get really lost. It is the wasteland. Yeah. All right. Zach? Uh. <laughs> uh. All right. <laughs> just sloth squat. I'm pretty much just sloth squatting behind this rock, <laughs> hoping it doesn't see me. Suka, <laughs> bleh! All right. So Peter's going to move up to there. And Odloff, it is your turn. Well, since I don't know what it is yet. Oh, yeah. 
All right, you're really hidden. <laughs> okay. Um, I can't even. If there's any time to crit on a stealth, it's when a death claw appears. Um, that being said, <clears throat> you guys can kind of hear what sounds like a very loud yawn. And um, something starts sniffing the air. Is it the death call that I'm focused in on? Jeez, it's your turn, but you can roll me a perception. Sure. Um... Oh, I'm between a rock and a hard place right now. Oh, yeah. Roll me a perception. Uh... I don't think I got a very good perception. <coughs> but I still heard it. Yep. Um, all right. That being the case, I am going to ready an action again to shoot the death claw if need be. And can I use my other action to do another perception? Yes, you may. I'm not giving pretty much what you already know. God damn. All right. Preach is your turn. Okay. So, go shit. Go Actually, it's going to I'm going to slide down here. Go over here. Then I'm going to Misty Step for my bonus action up to here. All right. And then I'm going to use my last action to move. Lie down here. Make my way over there. What a tactical god. <laughs> I try. Hey, I just want everybody to know the last uh, the last session I did that fucked up on acid. So <laughs> fuck you guys. <laughs> Brutus, it's your turn. Yeah, I'm trying to decide whether or not to run from south to north up the rock that is currently behind the death claw and jump on it from there, or. <laughs> Turn on the athletic rig and run up the staircase to the left and jump from the cliff. Both sound like epic, but at the same time, potentially horrible ideas. Cliff, 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 athletic rig, cliff, and athletic rig. 900 pound bear okay, going we down. We both know how this party works, and we always do something terribly stupid every session, <laughs> even if it's not in a session. <laughs> Very true. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I. It almost die. It is the wacky wasteland. It is. It is. All right, Brutus. Choice is yours. <laughs> Cliff, it is. So <laughs> I will move the character uh, one tile at a time just so I can get the count right. All right. Crouching tiger sneaking. <laughs> right, there, right there is 40. <laughs> With the athletic rig, you can move a fuck ton, can't you? Yeah, you can. I can move 80. Right where I'm at is 60. Is this where I need to jump from? 70 down. <laughs> so, yeah, you could jump from there, but you'll have to wait till your next turn. I also need a stealth check. Oh, God. Bear don't stealth well. <laughs> yeah, we know. <laughs> King Bear. Let's do it, guys. Come on, Bear. Okay. Come on, Bear. <laughs> okay. Fucking 14s tonight is the magic That's number, ladies and gentlemen. Am I, if I jump from here, do I need to do athletics or acrobatics? You're going to need to kind of wait for your next turn. Ish. 
I was doing a running jump. Like this is sixty. Oh. <laughs> okay, um, um, that's, that's a good that's one, Zach. Yeah, roll me, roll me athletics. Why is the bear always doing parkour? He's good at it, man. He's good. So, uh, he's, like, he's good at it. Like, all right. So you you managed to leap off the cliff. Give me one second. I gotta check something really quick. Yeah, you uh you are soaring through the air at this thing. Um, as you do, however, it turns and sees you. <laughs> Can I use my ready action? Um, no, you cannot. No, the cleaver's out. <laughs> I know. I need you to roll me. I need you to roll me in a tank with the cleaver, with the cleaver, because that's what you're using. Um, I'm gonna give you advantage because you're soaring through the air. Uh, <laughs> I'm right at the thing. Um, so you'll hit. Roll me damage. Here we go. <laughs> Does not. It takes 15 points of damage. Um, and you don't get a reaction against this attack because you are currently incapable of dodging. <laughs> you are flying through the air. I understand. Do I land on it next to it? Um, give me a second. Brutus uh, barrel roll. Uh, 15. Wow, a 15 does not hit you. It misses, so I will let you land on top of this thing if you want. Yes, I do. I want to land on top of it. Good roll God. Me, roll me a strength check. <laughs> uh, so you don't actually land on top of it. You knock it prone. <laughs> well, okay. <laughs> you, you've knocked over a purple worm and a death claw. That's what the bear's good for. <laughs> um, it is now the death claw's turn, though. <laughs> I don't get to use my ready to action. Okay, does he need a strength check to get me off him? Uh, I'm gonna, you're not getting your ready to action right now because it's knock prone kind of out of your sight. I'm just letting you know you're going to get it eventually, but right now it's got to be available right uh, first. Okay. Um, so, yeah, so it's knocked prone. You're on top of it. Um, go ahead and roll me a strength. Um, so yeah, you were like, this thing was knocked on its back and you're like standing on its chest and it's flailing around trying to get you off of it. <laughs> um, so it's going to use its other action to try to get you off only a strength. So it does manage to throw you off as it stands up and it throws you over here. Damn. You're going to take six, uh, fall damage essentially for being thrown. Um, and as it stands up, Elsa, feel free to go ahead and take your ready to action. Uh, that is less than 300 meters, right? Definitely. We're on standard scale. 22 26. will hit. Or 26 will hit. Yeah, both hit. Roll damage. All right. Uh, only five for the sneak, but. So 13 to the death claw. Um, it is no longer enjoying its lunch. Doc. So Doc sees this. And Doc's going to go, oh boy, here we here we go again. Here we go, kill it. I'm going to fix Brutus again. Um, so Doc's going to go over there. And going to ping the death claw for 10. All right. Zach, it is your turn. I'm just going to zip up behind this rock. Okay. And I guess I'll use a little more movement to uh, do that and try and pop off a single shot at him. All right. I didn't put semi auto, so only the first shot on this one. Gotcha. Uh, a 23 will hit, will be damaged. Amazing. 
<laughs> so Peter, um, seeing what they're fighting now, he's gonna spend his whole turn getting up here with <laughs> Odlaf. Well, Olaf. Um, roll me a quick perception, Odlaf. Okay, dokie. I'll be back in about a minute. I'm just gonna put a tip in, but I'm gonna beat myself to do it. All right. So I'm just letting you know. Oh, these. Oh, I forgot these things had DR. Um, so I'm just letting you know. Oh, won't forget that again. I'm just letting you know this thing doesn't have a roll on a new stealth. Um, the other one is now awake. Oh, happy, happy, joy, joy. Thank God that got seen before I went behind that fucking rock. <laughs> that was helping. That was happening. He's like, <clears throat> yeah, sleeping too. That was the big yawn you heard when Zach actually woke it up. Oh, well, with that, I'm going to pop my way this way behind the rock. <laughs> and then Mama Bear's getting a full diddle. All right. You got one, two, two hits. All right. 14 damage. All right. It is now the other one's turn. Hey, Billy. Yeah. Hold off. Um, what was your last stealth roll? 29. Okay. That's what I thought. Um, so this one doesn't like what's happening over here. It woke up and said something's fucky. <laughs> There's something fucky going on. Um, so it's running over here. Oh, good God. Jesus, uh, yeah. it's running. I'm yeah. assuming I don't need a perception to see no, it run. No, you don't. Okay, so bonus action. Um, actually, no, action to reload. Okay. Right. Switching right. one of them to movement and then running up here and going prone underneath looking underneath the bush if that's possible okay oh good for you and <coughs> i am rolling another stealth 24 solid all right breach all righty so I am going to claw my way up onto the top of this ridge here. Okay. Five, 15, 20. And if I attack, would I be able to get both of them in my cone of fire? Um... Using, using my split burst. You would my split automatic fire. You'd be able to Might go three. Hot in that. Yeah, what? you'd have to go three. You'd have to go three four. Um, um, but you're using automatic weapon, so you you'd have to wait to next turn because it's a full out of attack. Ah, oh, okay. Uh, then I guess I'm just gonna pop shots at this one with uh, my one shouldering it. Okay. It's funny as this is all going on. I can hear Zach screaming. Get the gun up, get the gun up, get the gun up! <laughs> so, your single shot hits whichever one you pick. Uh, the one that's uh, got burns right now. All right, roll me damage. All right. Okay, it is Brutus's turn. So I got thrown against the wall, right? Yeah. You're not prone, by the way. Okay, yeah. How big is the one in front of me? How tall is it? Uh, Probably pushing like 15 to 20 feet tall. Okay, I'm just trying to figure out if I could, if it's worth turning on the athletic reg and using the wall like a track runner does and tackling this thing since it's only five meters away from me. Okay. Or just shooting it with a shotgun. Either one. Or both. Cool. 
Could I do both? No. Okay, I think shotgun for now. All right, roll it. Come on, Big Bertha, hit. <laughs> you missed. Do I get a second shot? You do get a second shot. You missed. But you did roll 100 on the jam, right? <laughs> yeah. But you missed. It's now this How guy's turn. How do I miss with a shotgun? You did just get thrown against the wall. <laughs> uh, so it's now this thing's turn. Uh, I'm just going to step up in your face. All right. I need the action from Brutus. You need a what? Uh, you're going to get hit by this melee attack, so I need your reaction. Okay. So are you going to dive out of the way? Are you going to try to counterattack? Is it swinging with the left or the right? Both. Uh, can I hold the shield up and let it hit that and break its hands across the spikes? Um, you may. Roll me a strength save. Uh, all right, you take... Let me roll something real quick. Take three points of damage um, as you manage to superimpose the shield between yourself and the Death Claws hugging the attack. Um, but the sheer force of this thing impacting your shield jams your shoulder a bit. Um, and it okay. takes... Three damage itself from slicing its claws and hands open on the spikes of your shield. Say that again? It hurt itself by clawing your spiky shield. Gotcha. Being said, it is Doc's turn. Doc is going to try to ping this thing. Twice. Pinged! For 10. Zach! The <laughs> uh, all right. The military rig real quick. All right. This bitch with a fully automatic burst. All right. Remember this is... You have it set up for the no recoil, right? Yep. Uh, I've got a I've got a separate one on here for. All right. So you get three hits. Twenty-four. Uh, all right. Um, Peter. What does Peter have? Peter is going to take 62,000 shots. Two shots of his M1 Grand. Peter, I have to tell James, but I actually rolled for his character and his character hit. Uh, <laughs> it's because it's one, not him. <laughs> um, it's on the one in front of Zach. Um, all right. Olaf, it's your turn. Well, seeing what I just saw, I'm going to go back to the other side of my rock. <laughs> And full auto on the one that, that's attacking Brutus. Okay. You get one, two, three, four, five damage rolls. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, let's see, it's 20, 29, 33, 40. That was a really good roll. Yeah, it was. <laughs> yeah, it was. All right. Now it's the one in front of Zach's turn. All right. <laughs> so, Zach, I need a reaction from you. Fucking combat rolling out of the way. <laughs> roll me a deck save. 
Okay. So you dive roll. I'll let you pick the dire- five feet in the direction you want to roll. It's a DC uh, one. <laughs> behind the rock, I'm assuming. Oops. I didn't mean to go that way. That's going to look weird for a second. Right there. <laughs> um, but you didn't roll quite fast enough. You take six damage as it manages to just get your back. Uh, that's not the worst. Roll me a d100. Oh, fuck. No. Oh. oh, God. So, you hear something sparking, and as you check your military rig, it cut one of the support wires, so it's useless until you get it repaired. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I just got this thing, you <laughs> bastard. Use the force, Zach. Use the force. Jesus, it's your turn. She's typing it out. Mm-hmm. Yep. Go for oh, it. Gotcha. All right. Okay. That's an 11. All right. Um, you see what you see. Okay. But I'm sliding in as well. Okay. Is that your turn? That's my turn. Yep. All right. Preach. All right. So I'm going to lay down now, setting up the bipod. Okay. And I'm going to let... Uh, the one in front of. <laughs> I want to let this one have it. Okay. The, the one that's gone after Zach. All right. Do you hit? The whole thing the... will hit. Oh, good God. It is a 1919. Oh, yeah. I'll calculate Based that all. preacher. Okay. He is laying down holy metal right now. All right. So, Zach, you hear the you hear preacher's gun roar off with a burst, and this thing just screech in pain as kind of like blood splatters all over the place. And you can tell this thing is now a lot worse for wear. Gnarly, dude. Brutus, it's your turn. Yep, since this thing is right in my face, I'm going to try with the bang stick again. Okay. Zach, like I think someone's knocking on my door. Uh, you hit it with the Sega. For three damage rolls. Forty-four. Yep. Yeah. How's it looking? Really hurt. Then I'm gonna shoot it again. Okay. You missed. I'm back. And you jammed. <laughs> yep. <coughs> All right. It's now this thing's turn. Doesn't like you, Brutus. I know where. <clears throat> All right. I need some sort of reaction. What's it doing? Oh, it's trying to rip your face off. Can I push off the wall with the shield forward? You can try. Uh, roll me a strength then. Um, you managed to shove it back enough to stop a couple of its attacks from coming through. But um, as you shove it back, um, you feel intense pain as one of its horns manages to 
dig into your shoulder and you take 12 piercing damage. Mm. Left or right shoulder? Uh, it doesn't matter. It's not an injury yet. Okay. All right, Doc, seeing the trouble that, that Brutus is in, is going to take a quick shot. Hit. Or not enough. Four. Takes off running to go save Brutus. That's the kind of person she is. Zach, it's your turn. Zach, you better put rounds into this fucking thing. Sorry, I was in the middle of I'm I'm in the middle of typing an email. I'm gonna touch this guy up real quick with a full standard burst. Okay. You still get three hits. Um. Uh, he jammed. 